All right, we're gonna get right into this video, man. Before we do, Instagram shout out is going to go to Miss Crystal Hicks or the real SBBY on Instagram, man. She says, hey, I'm such a fan of you on YouTube. I was wondering if you can do a reaction video to Queen Nige's new song called Pack Light. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, man. And shout out to you, Miss Crystal Hicks. Thank you so much for the follow and thank you for the request as well. Now, I had already recorded my reaction to Queen Nige's Pack Light. All right, and the video was blocked, okay, in every country because I guess it was copyrighted, whatever the case may be. So I spent that time reacting to that video for nothing, all right, but it's all good. But anyway, guys, just know that I did try and just a really quick review. I think Pack Light was a cool song. It's not something that I would actually bump in the car but nothing wrong with the song. I feel like it was shot very well and the concept was really dope too. That spin at the end where we all found out, we all thought this nigga was cheating at first, but come to find out, he was actually trying to keep the secret that he bought his wife or his, uh, I think it was his wife or his woman a car, which is Queen Nyjah. And that's what you end up finding out. So spoiler alert, sorry if you haven't watched the video, but I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have. I thought it was a dope video, dope concept to be honest. And shout out to Queen, man. Anyway, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another lit ass video. Make sure that you DM me at the Diamond Life 888. Let me know what I should be reacting to next. Then tell a friend to tell a friend to tell angel mom to tell Uncle Joe, he's still a hoe. Let's get right into this motherfucking video, y'all. So, a lot of you guys have been wanting me to do a part two, dos, dos equis, okay, on Lawrence and Damo, all right? Miss Dominica Wilson and Mr. Lawrence H. Robinson, okay? Rico, Rico Suave in the flesh. Damo did go on Instagram and said a few things, answered a few questions, and there was some exchanges between her and Lawrence. I already knew that they were a little flirtatious and I thought maybe they might have had a crush on each other or something like that. But other than that, I know Damo stated that they are just friends, at least for right now, okay? So we're just gonna go over some of the things that Damo has said and some of the exchanges really quickly. This shouldn't be a long video at all. So let's just enjoy while we got the time, all right? Somebody says, why don't you like stud Damo? It was a part of your life you should embrace. First of all, don't tell that lady what to do, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, she gonna do her. If she don't wanna be stud Damo no more, yeah, she not gonna be stud Damo. So it is what it is. So she said, it's not like I don't like old Damo, cause Damo's still Damo. It's just like how you feel when you look back at old pictures of yourself in high school, same thing, LOL, no different, okay? So she basically says that she has grown into who she is now, and now it feels weird, you know, for her to continue, I guess, that old look or whatever the case may be, even though sometimes she does switch it up, all right? So next, do you ever wish you had more pics of you dressed more feminine with Dominique as an infant? And she said, and girl, yes, I think about this so much. It's annoying, LOL, all right? Do you think you'll have another child in a couple of years? She says, yes, for sure, mommy of two. What it do, okay? And we all know that she want another baby, that's no question. How she's gonna do it, we don't know, but Something inside me feels like she is going to do it with someone. That's just my personal opinion. I don't know. Because the first time that she tried to do that, of course, we know what happened there. So maybe she might be scarred from that experience. I don't know. But something tells me that it will be with a special somebody. All right. Somebody said, are you talking to someone or feeling someone? She says, I'm going with the flow of life right now with the stone face, stone face killer. And I'm gonna tell y'all translation what that means. That means she is talking to somebody or she is feeling somebody or she wants to be talking to somebody, okay, that she is feeling. That's just how I take that. I'm going with the flow of life right now, okay? Because if you're not talking to someone or you're not feeling anybody, you're just gonna say straight up, no, I'm not. But she actually said, I'm going with the flow of life right now, meaning that it's a little bit more than just not talking to anybody, okay? That's just how I feel next. When will you realize Lawrence is in love with you? She says, y'all dramatic as fuck. That man is not in love with me. Hey, I don't know. I My opinion on Lawrence is he's a slow criminal, okay? I feel like, I mean, I don't know the guy at all, but he seems to have genuine vibes, positive vibes, good vibes, and they seem to mesh well together. That's all I see. We don't know what happens behind camera. Behind camera, off camera. 
we don't know what happens. So I will just say, just judging off of what we do see, he does seem like a cool person. And um, you know, you never know what is going to come out of that. Now, is he in love with her? Probably not, especially if they have never done the do, okay? Which we will get to here in a second. So Damo posts this right here, acting crazy, of course, crazy Damo. She lets her personality shine. And that's why a lot of people love her, okay? We're gonna move on to the next slide. On that same post, Lawrence says, my baby girl. All right, and people, of course, are putting eyes. Oh, I see what's going on, blah, blah, blah. All right, Damo says, I love how you support me no matter how I decide to pop out that day. And he says, you perfect. Okay, so he laying down the Mac, all right? Now, whether it's genuine or not, I don't know. Not quite sure, but being that they are friends, it could be possible that he is being genuine. You just never know nowadays, okay? Moving right along. Somebody says, stop putting people in the friend zone and date Lawrence. Damo says, it's safe, okay? She's basically saying it's safe to put people in the friend zone and not date nobody because she doesn't want to put her heart on the line, which is definitely understandable. I get it. And um, that's just how she feels. All right, so Lawrence posts this to his IG. Caption reads, you should let me love you. Real friends got the same taste in music, okay? So of course this is copyright, so I'm gonna turn that bit down. But to me they look cute together, but it takes more than looking cute together to uh, make it work, okay? Trust me, <laughs> trust me. All right, so they were just vibing. On that post, Damo says, oh, I love you. Lauren says, I love you so much more though, with the smirk. Okay, of course, people were under the comment section saying, when you gonna wipe Damo, you need to wipe Damo, Damo got your cheese and like that. He actually likes every single post or every single comment he likes. So I don't know if he's entertaining the Damo comments just to entertain him or if he just likes every post or likes every comment. If you ask me, I feel like he just likes every comment and they probably both be laughing about the comment section too because niggas always trying to pair people together. So somebody says, you sure y'all just best friends? Somebody said, girl, they more than best friends. Shit, they screwing. <laughs> Damo says, I promise we don't. We kissed and it was one time for a music video way over a year ago. I would tell y'all, okay? So she's saying that she would tell her people if they were involved in something more than friends. And you know, like I said, we gotta take her word for it. We don't know their lives. And like I said, they're both good at marketing themselves. Possibly they're just wanting people to talk or possibly it could be a little something more, which I think that Damo might really like Lawrence. And I think Lawrence might like her too, but you know, I don't know. I don't know because Lawrence just seems like, you know, he just enjoys female company, which is fine, but I think Damo is looking for somebody who is just gonna be all about them, even though she says that she doesn't. I know ultimately that is what she's looking for. But anyway, guys, let me know your opinion. Let me know how you feel, man. Let me know how your day is going. It is currently about 2.50 p.m. here in Dallas, mother friggin' Texas. Let me know exactly where you are now that we have the comment section back up. Let me know where you are located, what you are doing, what your plans are for this weekend. I feel this week in general has just zipped by. Every day is like moving so quick. But like I say, man, stay prayed up, stay blessed. Everybody, make sure that you focus on the positive things in your life and the positive things will grow. I love you guys so much. If you have not already, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell so you can be notified every time I post another lit ass video make sure that you dm me at the diamond life 888 let me know what i should be reacting to next and tell a friend to tell a friend today ain't your mama today ain't uncle joe he's still a hoe i will see you guys in the next motherfucking video love y'all man peace and we out